Oh. So I'm, he I'm heading back to Scalloway to try and get some breakfast. To show. So we never had any beers or anything at all last night. And I still woke up feeling mildly hungover. But yeah, I was just chilling out at a Chinese. So we went down yesterday. Went to Scalloway Museum. Uh, learned about the Shetland bus. I learned about the Shetland bus, seen the Shetland bus memorial, then got a Chinese. And today we're headed up to Unst. Now, up to, so we get the ferry to Yell first, first island to Yell, and then on to Unst. Here, Seagull Church. Don't even know if there's a shop. Do we in petrol station? I'm never. I'm the most. I have to be the most northerly monkey bike in Scotland at the moment. This is crazy. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty sparse if it here and there's like, there's no trees. And everyone says there's no trees in Shetland, but it is, it's pretty, it's pretty surreal. I assume the land can see the distance. That was such to be mainly in Shetland. I think you can see the big mast, you can know, only see on the GoPro, but I can see a big mast on the horizon. I think that's pretty much just beside where the the rally was. And that's where the Simmer Dim was. What a food co-op.
That's nice, eh? Jeez, oh. That must be Ernst over there. Holy shit. Did you see that as an owl? So I think it was an owl. Is that an owl? So I think that's Fettler over there, and that's Unst up there. An orange bus stop. So a guy back there says, you take a right at an orange bus stop. And that takes you to fuel. A shop called Mary's. Oh yeah. This is Unst. Plugged in, so that is loud as anything. So I don't know where this hostel is that we're staying in, but I have seven eight, my dad said. Check this out. So this is Unst. I assume that's bolt of sound coming up. Number two for me. What time were you open till tonight? So the guys have stopped for a bite to lunch, a bite to eat, and uh, there's a petrol station sort of thing. But there's a few other options further up here apparently. At the spaceport, there's a restaurant. Believe it or not, there is a spaceport on Anst. So if you want to travel to space, come to Shetland. We'll fire you up. So we're, we're hoping to get somebody to eat at the spaceport. Apparently there's a restaurant. Let's 
that's a Ford Spaceport. This is a Spaceport. Surely this is the Spaceport. <laughs> Visitors of the site of space related business. <laughs> Authorized visitors are allowed at this site for security and safety reasons. Any aliens will be reported to the space police and transported to Mars. <laughs> Hello. Hello, it's okay, come in. Is, is there a cafe or a restaurant or anything nearby? I've not passed that yet. I came. No, I came. I came along by the coast. There's only one boat here. I know it. Honestly, I've not went past. I came the big boat. I came the big boat. You mean? I'm blind as I'm blind as a bat. On that tiny wee monkey bike, eh? Yeah. <laughs> you see it? I can see it. I Jesus Christ. <laughs> so, came up for East Lothian. <laughs> That's pretty cool. It's no bad, eh? It depends on the wind, it'll sit between, if it's a headwind, you're maybe doing 40, 45. If it's a tailwind, it'll sit at 60, 65. And I had it hitting the limiter on top. It's really good. Unfortunately, it's I had it hitting the rev limiter and the top gear coming down Glen Shee, and it was doing 77 on the speedo. <laughs> I don't know if they try and get on top of that radar station. Check out all these old ruined buildings. Wonder how long ago folk lived in them. Better be much more recent than you think. Good lord, it was van life. We're heading up to the radar bit, golf ball. Everyone loves a golf ball. That is quite loud. What a view! There's Muckle Flugger. You can see four miles.
hoping we can see the spaceport. Jeez, oh. But I'm going to come back over here the now. It's even a better view here than it is of the golf course. The golf course, golf ball. So I think that is Muckle Flugger, the lighthouse. So we'll head back down to the hostel. I don't know if I'm going to camp or not. Tempting just to camp, just as the beds are a bit short. And I mean, my, my tent's comfy, so why spend extra money if it would be less comfortable? So I don't know where the spaceport actually is. I'm going to call into the distillery again because that guy was very helpful. We're hopefully going to get a view of the spaceport. We will wait and see. There's no point in ripping along here because I've still got my Lomo back on the back. My Lomo bag on the back. I don't want to smash up my rack. The boy in the truck said it was okay to come this way. That was nice of him. I think that's the spaceport. So that is the spaceport there. Not much really to look at. <laughs> We're heading further north. I think this is the most north we can get, which would make it the most northerly point in Scotland, I think. Is this the most north we can get? Most north east. Where's the most north I can get my bike to? <laughs> it's a Herman S Nature Reserve. Right, I've been up there, so that's the most northerly point. Northerly point yeah. Get back, get food, get batteries charged. Right, now I don't know where I'm going. Nightmare. So on the way along here, you see this? Somehow I missed this. <laughs> Absolute zoomer. How the hell could I miss that? Yeah, I've got my bike outside it.
So this is like a Viking longhouse. I'm not 100% sure they had windows back in the day like, but... This is it. And there's your big fire. Sit in there, have a fire. All the smoke goes up through there. Quality. And here's the boat. So it's a replica of an actual boat that was um, found in Norway. That's where your mast would go. It's cool. Check it out. So I don't know how I managed to ride past that, but I did. Here's looking good today. So I'm waiting for Andrea, one of the bad points of a little bike, is he kind of fed anything on it, and I left my backpack behind. But unfortunately, he can't find the, he can't find his way around. So I'll be there to hide all that. I might just hide it and then come back for it and we put it behind right that long grass over there. But anyway, it was anyway. Yeah. Yo, Tim! Hello! Did you find it? There's a sign up there on the top of the road that says Post Office. Nice little bit. So we're camping, well I'm camping at this view, this is a hostel at the bottom of Anst. Look at the weather we're getting. Time to get some food I think. But yeah, really nice. Anst amazing. Quality place. Very good. We're swimming stones. We're gonna definitely go for some food now. That's where we're staying. It's nice. Very nice. Someday. This is midnight on Anst. Here's my cap. Good night. <laughs>